बिस्मिल्लामान रहीम गुड मॉर्निंग डियर स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू द ऑनलाइन क्लास ऑफ डॉक्टर खस्तुगीर गवर्नमेंट गर्ल्स हाई स्कूल आफ्टर ए लॉन्ग ईद वेकेशन वी आर नाउ अगेन इन वर्चुअल क्लास होप यू ऑल यू ऑल आर हेल एंड हार्टी आई एम मुश्फिकात चौधरी एंड आवर टूडेज क्लास इज फोर क्लास एट स्टूडेंट्स and the subject is english first paper okay at the beginning of the class let's look at the pictures what can you see in this picture okay there are two pictures on the screen and in the first picture we can see that some passengers are going to travel and there is a plane and in the second picture what can you see yes in the second picture there is an immigration counter and some passengers are waiting over there okay let's move to the next slide and here is another picture what can you see in this picture yes we can see that some passengers are in the plane and a stewardess is serving something now my dear students think for one minute and guess what is our today's topic yes you are very much right our today's topic is about traveling okay our today's lesson is unit 6 going on a foreign trip lesson 1 at the airport lesson 2 filling in a form and lesson 3 going through immigration Okay after the class we will be able to read and understand text infer meaning from context write answers to the questions and write the main idea Dear students before starting the lesson let's take a look at the new vocabulary that you may encounter in this lesson There are five new words and these are Number one, lounge. Do you know what is the meaning of lounge? Lounge means a waiting room at an airport. Number two, immigration, and immigration means the process of entering another country. Number three, expire, and expire means to come to an end or terminate. And number four, renew. Renew means to make an arrangement to continue for a further period of time okay and number 5 valid which means officially acceptable so these are the new words uh, that is in the text okay okay dear students here is another picture look at the picture carefully what can you see can you guess the place who are the people in this picture yes it seems that this place is an airport and the people are some passengers waiting to fly so let's start the class and find out if our guesses are correct so my dear students let's start reading the text zara lives with her parents in london they have come to bangladesh to visit zara's aunt and uncle she is very close to her cousin mita both the families have visited many interesting places together in bangladesh it was great fun then they decided that they would visit some places outside bangladesh too they decided to go to thailand but mita's parents were too busy with their work so they could not go however mita was going with them mita zara and her parents are at hazrat shah jalal international airport they are waiting in the lounge Mita is very excited. This is her first time to board a plane. 
they are flying by Bangladesh Biman. Mitha is hoping to have a great time in Thailand. As they wait, the two cousins start planning what they would do once they reach Bangkok. Mitha's uncle brings forms for all of them to fill in before going. Through the immigration, he gives one to Mita and says, you have to give some information about yourself in the form. The immigration officer will check your passport and stamp it. And then you are ready to travel. Mita, Zara and her parents start filling in the forms. Dear students, now there are three questions uh, based on the previous text the text that we have just finished okay now you have to read the questions and write the answers of the questions in your copy so take 10 minutes of your time and write the answers in your copy uh, so i hope you all have finished writing the answers let's check the answers our first question is why is mita excited mita is excited as it is her first plane journey. Question number two. Why aren't Mita's parents going with her? Mita's parents are too busy with their work and so they aren't going with her. And our third question is what does an immigration officer do at the airport? Dear students, what is the answer? At the airport an immigration officer checks the passport of the passengers and stamp it. I hope you all have written the correct answer. Dear students, now we are in lesson 2 and uh, the name of the lesson is filling in a form. As we can see, there is a form on the screen and the name of the form is departure card. And uh, And it needs some information of the passengers to fill if to fill in the departure card okay so dear students here is another text about Mita and this text contains the important information of Mita and uh, we need to fill the departure card uh, that we have shown in the previous section on Mita's behalf okay Mita's full name is Mita Sultan Ahmed. She, she was born on 6th May 1998. She got her passport on June 09, 2010 and it's a 5 years passport. It will expire on 8 June 2015. After that, she has to renew her passport. Her passport number is AB9824251. She is going to Thailand by Bangladesh Biman, flight number BG88 on 14th July 2012. Mita got her visa from the Royal Thai Embassy in Dhaka. Her visa number is T9115138. The visa was issued in Dhaka on 29th June 2012. The visa is valid for 3 months. It will expire on September 27, 2012. It is a tourist visa. If you are traveling on a tourist visa, you are not allowed to study or work there. Dear students, we are in lesson 3 now and the name of the lesson is Going Through Immigration. So dear students, uh, there are two pictures on the screen. Uh, look at the picture carefully and try to answer the following questions. Why does a person need a passport? What are these booths for? Why are people standing in the line in front of them? And what are the persons doing inside the booth? Guess the answers of the questions and then let's move to the next slide where there is another text for you. Uh, so there is a text again about the traveling. Zara's parents, Mrs. Juma Islam, Mr. Mazharul Islam, Zara and Mita fill in their departure cards and move towards the immigration counter. 
Mita stands in front of one of the booths. She hands in her passport and the departure card to the officer. The immigration officer goes through Mita's passport, visa and the departure card. Are you traveling alone? asks the officer. No, I am going with my aunt, uncle and cousin, says Mita. They are right there on the counter. Is this your first visit to Thailand? Yes. How long are you going to stay there? 7 to 10 days. Where are you going to stay? In a hotel. The officer is talking as well as going through Mitha's papers. He finds the papers, okay? He smiles and stamps her passport. The officer keeps the departure card and returns the passport to Mita. Have a safe journey. Thanks. Mita waits for her aunt, uncle and Zara on the other side of the immigration. Once all of them are done, they walk towards the passenger's departure lounge. So my dear students, this is a conversation between the immigration officer and Mita. Okay. So let's move to the next slide and there is an exercise for you based on this conversation okay so dear students make a list showing what the immigration officer asks and tells Mita and what Mita says in response one is done here for you okay and now it is uh, the time for homework Write a short composition about your experience of traveling to another place. It could be going to your grandparents or aunts or sisters or brother's house. You have to write about your preparation before traveling, your experience on the way that is launch terminal or railway or bus station or airport etc. Okay. So, before ending the class, I must remind you to follow the rules of health. That is, wear masks, wash your hands frequently, avoid crowd and dear girls, thanks a lot for today.